I'm afraid I can't help you. <sighs> but your manager said you could give me a refund if I made an appointment. You're not on my appointment list, and you don't have a receipt. I, I don't even think we carry that version anymore. Listen, I don't need a new model, or store credits, or pennies. I just want my money back. There's nothing I can do without a sales record of some kind. I can go get the warranty book for my car. I'm afraid I can't help you. <sighs> but your manager said you could give me a refund if I made an appointment. You're not on my appointment list, and you don't have a receipt. I, I don't even think we carry that version anymore. Listen, I don't need a new model or store credit. Sounds like he might be trying to scam them. I'm gonna support the sales clerk. Are you keeping this guy at work while there's a war on? Uh, well, it's his job, right? Actually, I'm supposed to be on break. Contacting the family I haven't heard from in days. Uh, yeah. I guess maybe a war's a bad time. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. <laughs> that didn't cross your mind the other ten times you visited this week? Uh, yeah, sorry. I'll just, uh, yeah. I've never seen anyone so obsessed with getting a refund for a toaster oven. <laughs> Welcome to Alright, what else do we have here? Shotgun ultralight materials? Not a actually that's not a bad idea. Eight percent's not a lot though. That's the only thing. Because I'm gonna switch over to that heavier weapon. Our customer Let's leave it for now, but we'll know that it's here available to us. Shoulder guards. Professional grade equipment at reasonable prices. That's Cipratine. Let's grab these. I hope they can work with our current suit. Alright, so now we need to go see Barla Vaughn. And I actually I think I might know where he is. The colony's location is hardly ideal for our species. The clutch will be in peril if we do not act soon. Of course, I will do everything I can do to help. We are family. The extreme weather conditions may require technology that is not readily available on the market. Huh. Well, if we find those, then we can let him know. But I think there was like a bank or something. And I believe it's straight ahead. Yep. The bank of Barlevan. Here he is. Commander Shepard. It's been some time. It has. Bar Levon, in case you've forgotten. Financial advisor. And an acquaintance of Admiral Anderson. I admire the courage it took for him to stay and fight on your home world. I remember who you are. He used to be an agent for the Shadow Broker. I still am. The broker has been exceedingly oh. busy lately. A team of his guards have become stranded in a Reaper-controlled territory. Rescue the guards, and they're yours. The Shadow Broker fully supports your efforts against the Reapers. We can use anybody we can get. I appreciate the information. Just don't wait too long to act on it. The Reapers oh. are advancing all too quickly. Come see me once you've completed the extraction. I'll be in my office a while longer. The galactic market is in considerable flux. Okay. So that means we're going to need to get moving. Uh, where is it? Citadel Bar Levon. It's provided the location of Shadow Broker forces trapped in the Draenex system inside the Krogan Demilitarized Zone. Recruit them to the war effort and return to Bar Levon. But we don't have much time, so we should probably get there sooner rather than later which is good timing wise because we're gonna leave and Welcome, on our way Shepherd. out please select the destination oh no we still have to see Aria damn if you have a question please consult well what we can do is we can go and rescue these guys and then when we come back we'll see Aria now because arriving at docking bay we have to return. B24. Okay. Oh, they're on the viewing deck. Shepard, there you are. 
Commander Shepard, it's been far too long. Yes, it has. We live in interesting times. You so with Cerberus? A little too interesting. I couldn't get anywhere near you when the Alliance had you locked up. Relieved of duty. It was complicated. I'm sure it was. I'm surprised they didn't court-martial you. The Alliance isn't known for its flexibility. Doesn't matter now. Shepard, about Earth. We're gonna fight back. I'm all right. We'll figure out some way to even the odds. We have to. Everybody has a weakness. Even the Reapers. I'm sorry, Shepard. What about you? What brings you here? I need to talk to a few people. Like you. The Citadel is a good place to meet. For now. What's the Alliance's next move? We have a plan. It's a long shot. <sighs> Not surprising. Shepard? There's... something I wanted to mention. Uh-huh. What is it? I haven't heard from my sister, Oriana, for a while. I'm getting worried. Okay. Your sister? Yes. I don't want to overreact, but... Well, there's a lot going on. I thought we made sure she was safe. We did. It's probably nothing, but... I just know my father is involved. What happened? I don't know. Everything I had in place to make sure she was safe went dark. What do you need from me? I appreciate the offer, Shepard. But you have your hands full. If I need a door or two kicked down, I know just who to call. But for now, I'll be fine. Okay. I understand. I have to figure this out. Tell me what else is on your mind. You will. Have you had any run-ins with the elusive man? Just once. He said it had been a pleasure to work with me. Hmm. But he needed to contain the situation. Contain the situation? Sounds final. It nearly was. He doesn't take rejection <laughs> well. No. He doesn't. Why do you think your father was involved in Oriana's disappearance? I kept careful tabs on my sister. I always knew where she was. For her to just vanish, it could only be him. After I hid her away, I still knew he'd stop at nothing to find her. She's all he has left. I have a hunch what happened. But I'll fill you in when I'm certain. Okay. It's been a long time. What happened to you? I've been in hiding. Being on the run from just about everyone isn't as glamorous as it sounds. I didn't know. It's all right. I knew there would be repercussions to walking away from Cerberus. I imagine. You're a dangerous enemy. I am. If you're looking for a lead here, anyone associated with Cerberus will be hard to find. No question. But I'm owed a few favors. Someone here will give me a tip on Ariana. Okay. I've got to get back to it. And I should get out of sight. Be careful. Let me no know if promises. you need help. Good luck. So we will we'll talk to Cortez, and then you know what? We will actually go and talk to Jacob and Oriana. You finally made it off to Normandy. Glad I did. Even with the chaos of all the refugees, seeing so many ships in flight is comforting. Gets me thinking. Hey, a Turian frigate. I think that's the PFS Havenkar. What's one Turian warship doing at the Citadel? Looking for dry dock, I bet. She's seen battle. Look at the waiver in her drive core emissions. Alone, limping, looking for a haven. Maybe it would have been better to just go down fighting, like their families back home. Are you talking about the Turians or yourself? I should have been there. With Robert. I'm glad you weren't. You'd be dead, and we'd never have met. Yeah. That's the one good thing from all this. I'm glad to serve with you, Shepard. We'll get them back. The Reapers are expecting victory. They won't get it. Nobody is giving up. Not those Turians. Not me. Not you. If anyone can pull this all together, it's you. And I'm with you. I gotta oh. let go. For real this time. The refugees here put up a memorial wall. They leave mementos of lost loved ones. I was thinking maybe... What's stopping you? 
Nothing. I mean, let me think about it. Go do it. Your suggestion to come out here was a good one, Commander. I needed this. Okay. Let's, uh, so let's head back in. Contrary to what I was just saying, let's head back in and talk to, uh, Jacob and Arya Talok. And then that'll keep things clean. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. Now arriving at okay, so we're here. Purgatory. We've got the VIP lounge and then the lower bar. Let's see. What am I looking for here? I don't even actually have anything that states anything about Arya Talok. But we just know that she's, that we need to see her. I hate being stuck here. I hate this guard duty assignment. I hate everything right now. Nothing to do about it. We each stand duty in our own ways. At least your wife and the kids went on that trip you mentioned a while back. Where was it again? They canceled the trip. Donated the funds to some charity when Earth was hit. And then... How? Shit. I'm sorry. I know people are complaining. We're doing what we can with what we've got here, but... Let me finish. Our power grid can only handle so much power before it shuts down, and we can't use the backups. No, the new regs apply to the whole Citadel. Management knows this is important for morale, but we can't go over budget. Look, I'm not touching the backups. Get me a better power grid, I'll give you a bigger light show. Okay, well, we'll keep our eyes open as well, and hopefully remember where she is when we find it. Didn't think I was making it off of any. No, neither did I. They had it. If he hadn't drawn their fire, well, we wouldn't have made it. Nope. Not a goddamn chance. I couldn't have done that. What he did. Hmm. Hey, you ready to get this party started? Hey, now you're, uh, here. <laughs> Hell yeah, I'm here. For the next 48 hours, I'm spending as much time in this bar as humanly possible. Yeah, we had the same thought. So, um, the bar's over there. Oh, and, shit. Uh, he wants to shut her hey, down. Hey, is the whole squad here? Hey, guys. Um, yeah. We were going to, uh, guys night. Uh-oh. She is not going to like that very much. Okay, so let's go and see James. Is anybody... Is this... Oh, that's going to be her. So let's go see James first. There he is. Hey, Commander. Nice to see you down here in the dirt with us grunts. You don't think I like getting dirty? Whoa, whoa now. Come on. I didn't mean anything by it, loco. Uh-huh. What'd you mean, then? See those Marines over there? None of them officers, just soldiers fighting the war. Yeah? They've been buying me drinks all night. You know why? Same reason they got all quiet and serious when you walked in. <laughs> and that's probably how you look at me. You don't seem intimidated by me in the least. In fact, you could use a little more deference. <laughs> sure, but I've fought with you. I've seen you in action. Now, don't get me wrong, you're good. Probably one of the best. Probably. But I know you're human. Just like me. But not them? Nope. Hell, I still remember the day they made you the first human specter. I watched it on the vids, just like all of them. But to them, you're still larger than life. I get it. Maybe I should expect it. There aren't a hell of a lot of people who've done what I have. And now they get to meet you in the flesh. You should buy them around. It'll impress them. I'm not going to buy it to impress them, but I'll buy it because I'll support them. I like the way you think, Lieutenant. Compadres! Hey! 
The commander would like you to have a drink. On him. So here's to us. Who's like us? Damn few. And they're all dead. Hoorah. It's an honor meeting you, Commander. Thanks. But we're all in this together. Every one of us has a part to play. True enough. Cheers. Cheers. Not bad, loco. I was hoping you'd know that one. Thanks for the warning. Thanks for the drink. <laughs> That's it? He just turns his back? something to bring back their fighting spirit. Remember the stories of the first regiment on Castellus? Outnumbered, knowing they would die, but they fought for the Empire. That's the spirit we need if we're going to hold power. I feel really bad for the Turians. Like, I mean, everyone's going through shit, but... It's just, it's bad for everybody. <laughs> Arya. So you admit you and your thugs are here illegally? Yes, and it only took C-Sec three weeks to figure it out. I don't care who you are. You're required to go through processing like all other refugees. Come with me. I don't think so. Shirk, get me the Asari counselor. Uh-oh. Greetings, Arya. Is there something you need? I'm being asked to submit to immigration processing. Of course you are. Done. What else can I do for you? Nothing. Thank Jeez, you. She is connected. My pleasure. I think we're done here. Enjoy the show, Shepard? A little bit. I guess there's one rule on the Citadel, huh? I guess so. I hate this place. So sickeningly uptight. Then why are you here? Cerberus stole Omega from me. The elusive man is now squarely at the top of my shit list. You will pay for every second I've spent in this bureaucratic hellhole. How did Cerberus defeat you? Deceit, distraction, and a big fucking army. They lured me away from Omega and ambushed me. I escaped, but Cerberus had already laid siege. By the time I could launch an assault, they were too entrenched. Good news is you're still here. At least you escaped to fight another day. And that day is coming. I'll take Omega back, but I'll get to that. You're here because I have a proposition. Really? Big surprise. I'm listening. The way I see it, if you don't defeat the Reapers, we're all dead. Won't matter where I'm sitting. It's in my interest to help you. What are you offering, Arya? On Omega, I kept the Blood Pack, Blue Suns, and Eclipse in check. Now they're running amok. Nobody wants that. Unite them under my rule, and you'll have a powerful and ruthless force. It's actually for not war. a crazy, I've terrible idea. I've laid the groundwork idea. with all three groups. Not that bad. I just need you to close the deals. I'll do whatever it takes. Like, they're not the greatest people, but we need people to fight. If they'll fight Reapers, I'll take them. Now that's a bottom line I can respect. Meet with Narl, my agent who's dealing with the Blood Pack. The Blue Sun's leader is incognito here on the Citadel. He'll be expecting you. And I already have a deal with Jonas Sedaris, the Eclipse leader. You just have to get your friend, Commander Bailey, to let her out of jail. You Jeez. obviously don't know Bailey very well. No. Bailey respects you. Lean on him. I think a united force of professional mercs is worth it. Don't you? It is, but if you screw me over... It's always a pleasure, Shepard. Let me know if you want to talk later. So that means... So we need to talk to... Let's see. Let's see. The Eclipse. So is requested assistance uniting mercenary bands under her control. Speak to Commander Bailey's assistant at the Presidium Common C-Sec Station and gain the allegiance of the Eclipse band. We also have uh, Darner Vosk in the Citadel refugee camp and gain alliance to the Blue Suns. And then speak to Narl in the Presidium Commons and gain the allegiance to the Blood Pack. So they're all here on the Presidium. 
or, uh, sorry, on the Citadel, which is awesome. And I guess we can probably take care of that relatively soon. But before we do that, we need to check out the D floor. Can I get in here? Anybody? No? Good, because I didn't want to hang out with any of you either, so we're good then. So we're not quite done with the Citadel just yet. Rapid transit. No, we're okay. We can take the elevator. Welcome, Commander Shep. One moment, please. Said one of the guys is expecting me. Okay, Narl's in the apartments, which is perfect because. Where is this going? Because if this isn't serious, then we need to talk. These are two different things. You're important to me, but I. It's not healthy to rush from one relationship to another. Well, I need to rush somewhere. If I end it with him, then I lose my partner benefits, and that includes my apartment. Okay, so maybe just for your own security. You need to figure out an exit strategy before you talk with Things him. Things are getting dicey I in this relationship. I had. And I cherish the time we've had together. But, uh oh yeah. Uh-oh. I have a feeling the next time we're here, they won't be. This is not going well for them. Knock, knock. Quick, hands behind your back. Over here any minute. What the hell are you talking about? Crete, Blood Pack's leader. Maria brings him the great commander Shepard. Crete pledges the gang to her. We're just luring him into the open so we can take him out. What? Not the best start to our friendship, Nero. He's coming. Put your hands behind your back and uh, try to look like I beat you up or something. I swear to God, I will kill you if you're lying to me. If this goes wrong, it's your ass. Quiet! I have to look even more powerful than Crete thought. Her instructions on boarding Citadel undetected were one thing. Now this... <sighs> Commander Shepard wants you to know your head will be hood ornament on my personal shuttle. <laughs> Keep your distance, Crete. So, do you agree to Arya's terms? Most definitely. Arya can use blood pack as she sees fit. Wasn't talking to you, Crete. Quill? What? You have my word. Now open fire! Oh! Not him. Quill's next in line to take over. Arya's deal is with him. Yes! Yes! I'm Arya's mole, Shepard. Nice, You've Krill. scratched my back. Now I'll scratch yours. Word of advice. Don't double-cross Arya. Or me. I may be ambitious, but I'm not crazy. Uh-huh. Good work, Narl. Thanks for the gun. Anytime, Shepard. Grill and I will let Arya know the light is green. Okay, good work. Mm -hmm. One down, two to go. Now the other person is, let's see. Commander Bailey's assistant at the Presidium Common CSEC station and gain the allegiance of the Eclipse Band. Okay, where is the CSEC area? CSEC outpost is back here. We actually went in there at one point, but nothing much was happening. Are you the man? No. Hmm. Maybe it's the, uh, sorry, we're in the commons, and I think we need to be in the, uh, let's see. Yeah, it says here. 
Speak to Commander Bailey's assistant at the Presidium Common CSEC station and gain allegiance to the Eclipse Band. That's strange. This is the place. That's really weird. What we'll do is we'll go see the other one first and then maybe come back. So we'll go to the refugee camp in the Citadel. At the docking station. I wonder if I can just go talk to Bailey himself. Because his assistant doesn't seem to be very helpful. Welcome, Commander Shepard. One moment, please. Now arriving at Docking Bay E24. Emergency civilian housing. And do we have a location? We do. Okay, he's in Garrus's area. Can I ask, where were you when the Reapers... Would you shut up? I'm sorry? I don't want to hear it. You humans think you had it rough? You know what happened on Karshan? My apologies. I thought this was your homeworld. Stop! Just stop! Okay, here's Darner Vosk. Wow. Arya wasn't kidding. The great Commander Shepard on a leash. I'm here for my own reasons, Vosk. Oh, sure you are. Anyway, tell her I'm impressed, but to do business, I still need my little problem taken care of. Which is? A Torian general named Oraka has it out for the Blue Suns. He's raising a stink over our activity in this sector. I'll commit my gang to Arya as soon as Araka's dead. Oh, I'm not gonna kill him. There must be more to Araka's complaint. We're just making little raids along trading routes. With Arya's blessing, I might add. Araka's just some military fossil who came out of retirement to relive the glory days and justify his existence. Losing him won't affect your war in the least, but gaining the Blue Suns, well, you know our work. You seriously think I'll assassinate a Turian general? Arya seems to think so. Or else, why would she send you? She knew the price. The two of you work it out. Oh, God, really? Oh, and, uh... <laughs> tell Arya I still expect her blue ass in bed with me. Oh, God. I don't like this guy. Can we take the other two and not him? What is it, Shepard? You knew about this? Can you be more specific? Darner Vosk expects me to kill General Araka. Who cares what Vosk wants? What he needs is for Araka to stop disrupting his operations. Okay. I figured you'd talk to Araka, see if you can get him to lay off. And if he won't listen to reason, call me, and I'll take care of it. I don't see the distinction. The distinction is that I'm giving you the chance to save his life. Right. Why didn't you just tell me this yourself? Yeah, he yeah, mentioned that I'm going to slit his 